what happens when some of the reactants give out heat and what happens when others absorb heat. If a reaction gives out heat, it's called an exothermic reaction. And if it absorbs heat, it's called an endothermic reaction. You have exothermic reactions happening inside you. When glucose gets oxidized, energy is given out and is used to mint our energy currency ATP. Let me put this in a graph so that it will become very, very simple for you, okay? So you must have actually noticed that we have instigated some reactions to happen. That instigation was normally heat. And this is done because reactants are usually stable in their own form. A small push or a trigger is needed to get them going and getting them to react. This energy that is given is called activation energy. After this, the reaction becomes spontaneous, goes ahead and forms different products. Now, two things can happen. One, products can be at a higher energy level than the reactants, which means that they have absorbed the energy. In this case, the reaction is called an endothermic reaction. And if you ask me for some examples of an endothermic reaction, the biggest example would be photosynthesis, a process by which plants are capable of the magical process of making their own food. This is an example of an endothermic reaction. Now you can show this in an equation as uh, carbon dioxide plus water plus energy in the presence of chlorophyll, giving you glucose and oxygen. Now, if products are at a lower energy level than the reactants, this means they are giving out energy and this is called an exothermic reaction. Examples, digestion, respiration. And if you want to show respiration in an equation, you have C6H12O6, that is glucose plus oxygen, giving you carbon dioxide, water and energy. Some more examples, burning of a candle is exothermic, burning of natural gas is exothermic, now, how would you show burning of gas in an equation? CH4 plus oxygen giving you CO2 and H2O. Even decomposition of vegetable matter into compost is an example of an exothermic reaction. The explosion that saved you and brought you back home safe and sound. As a matter of fact, all explosions are some of the most violent exothermic reactions. To keep learning with such engaging videos, download Baiju's The Learning App today.